So now we have two, and then my mom was coughing. So my mom and Judah, who was sick today, both got tested. And it yeah. would be, I'd be surprised if they didn't have it. Well, yeah, that's what I was, I was concerned about it. That I got tested and I was negative, so. That's good. And you were symptomatic yeah. when you got tested, so. Right. Pretty solid, yeah. Did his temperature come down? Is he, I hope he's I, down. I've never had it. Yeah, he's been down. His temperature's gone down. Um. <laughs> he's, he's been running a fever all day, but not that hard. Right. Nice, Tim. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Sure I never had a fever, though, but, so maybe, but I guess that's not always a yeah. sign. Yeah. They're all different. Yeah. So I am. Uh, Where's everybody's puppies? Where's all the dogs? Huh. Ours is passed out. Yeah. Ours is passed out. I took her for a while. Right here. But Maggie, you're feeling okay, right? You never had any symptoms or anything? No, yeah, Matt, yeah, Maggie's fine. Oh, yeah, now. no, I'm good. Yeah. Our dog's asleep too. Which oh, Penny is on her throne. Oh, Jesus. No, she's up right here. Oh, there we go. There's... Okay. There's but how do I see what I'm showing them? It should be in one of the corners. Right, do I need to do something? So, okay. I see. Uh, oh. Oh, yeah. There's a dollar club, baby. Oh. oh, those are Owen's feet. I thought that was Penny on the throne. No, Penny's right here on the couch. Oh, oh she's, she's all passed is. out. Ours doesn't have to. Where's Miss Piper? Piper's asleep on the couch, too. We're going to keep it that way. <laughs> she's a wild child. Yeah. Where is she? Sleep is best keeper that way. <laughs> I can try to show you. Um, let's see something. Let's just see. Oh my. <laughs> she keeps getting bigger every day. It's <laughs> passed out. Yeah, I know. <laughs> so, so all of you have sleepy dogs. Mm. What are you trying to do? Are you going to turn the audio off on here? No, I guess I, I need to. We didn't have that issue. No, we didn't because, and the lag is kind of long too. Jeff, is that a full size tree or is it a tabletop tree? This is, oh, I like them. It's full size. I can probably. Full size. It's a just a, it's a, I wouldn't say it's full size. It's like mid size. But it's standing on the ground. It's standing it's on the ground. Skinny. Yeah, because yeah, I. Oh, yeah, we moved oh, the yeah, table. Oh, yeah, we moved the table. A binge pipe main menu screen offers a little something for everyone.
Binge Pipe is the only streaming service to determine that people really needed to hear a voice talking to them all the time when they first interacted with the user interface. And we refuse to course correct on that decision. As a mom, I used to stay up nights worried about what my kids were watching on TV. But then I got Binge Pipe. With hours and hours of quality movies, TV programs, and game shows, I haven't had time to worry about my kids at all. Whoa, a movie about a horse that's also a doctor? <laughs> Looks like I'm missing another dance recital. There is no bottom to Binge Pipe's content pit. Here's something else to fall for. Ma'am, excuse me, I'm with the show What's in Your Purse, and I was wondering, what's in your purse? You wanna go through my purse? Okay, what is this, a prank show? No, just like a man on the street thing. Are you sure you don't mind? <laughs> no, no, it's fine. I'm just a little embarrassed to say I don't know what all is in here. I haven't cleaned things out in a while, so we got brush and some mints and napkins from a drive through and oh my God. Oh, it's, um, I don't know how. Wow, wow. Is that a dead bird? Yeah, yeah, it is. It, you wouldn't have known this, but I used to be a magician's assistant like like 15 years ago, and the last trick I assisted on was a bird trick. And that's the bird? One never reappeared. And the incredible Benjamin said, just wait. Wow, just wow. Do you want us to get rid of that bird? No, I'm good, thanks. I've had enough of your excuses. You're the reason we keep losing. If you love high drama shows like Survivor and Big Brother. Ugh, Susan's drunk again. That's it. House meeting right now. You'll just love. I don't like these people. I'm just trying to win. My family movies. I'm sorry, Chris. You contribute the least. You have to leave the house. <laughs> no excuses. You lost the vote. This isn't really a show. I just have to share it with someone. This game now comes in a variety of scents if you have certain forms of synesthesia. Streaming now on an all new Lion Punch. I am the Lion Punch. A troubling revelation. Master of the demon ways. Protector of the five shards of the Krog Korgon. We bought three seasons of this show. I have to avenge my father, and that's what I'm going to do because I have to do it. But the main guy is not very good. Lion Punch, this is a suicide mission. I won't follow you just to watch you destroy yourself. I have to avenge my father no matter what. I have to do it, and I will do it with or without you. Actually, you know what? I better come along after all. But at least he's one hell of a fighter. Punch! Punch! Boom! Uh, flip around! Oh, uh, no wait, he's, he's pretty bad at that too, actually. That's Lion Punch on Binge Pipe. Please, just, just give it a chance. Lion Punch! Oh, ow, my hand! Hey kids, do you like sharing? Yeah! Do you like oversharing at a work event, causing a cataclysmic rift between you and your peers that you can never erase? This week on Captain Fun Time's World of Hard Adult Lessons. While we wait for players to join, why not pour yourself your favorite drink and hold it in front of the screen so that we can see if our targeted advertising is working. Have questions? Call our Binge Pipe customer support party line. Hi, I'm locked out of my account. Hey, <laughs> Like, 
Want to make out? I'm sorry. Is there a binge pipe representative in here? Representative. 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 You'll figure it out together. But is it the same? Oh, okay, it's a different bald guy. Thank you. Binge Pipe not only streams the highest quality programming other services passed on, but we also create original content based around our users' most frequent search terms. Please enjoy the following. Knock, knock. Who's there? Interrupting Cal. Oh, no, you don't, you son of a bitch. Not this time. Honey, who was that? Where are the kids? Why did you yell? Who's at the door? Are the kids home? Yes, they're upstairs. Baby, you're scaring me. We can't stay here. What's happening? It's nothing. It's just something from my past. I can handle it. Now, please go upstairs and pack an overnight bag. I want you and the kids staying at your mother's tonight. If it's nothing, then why are we having to run away? There's nothing to worry about. I said I've got this. Mommy, Daddy, what's wrong? Hey, sport. <laughs> Mommy and Daddy were just having a conversation. Conversation. How does a sleepover at Grandma sound tonight? We'll order a pizza. Awesome. Honey, someone's at the back door. God damn it. I told you not to mess with my family. Mommy, why is Daddy breaking a chair? I'm not sure. Why are you breaking a chair, Roger? Because I've got to board this door up, Maggie. Look, everything's gonna be fine. I just need you to grab my shotgun from the closet. Roger, you're scaring me. I swear, I'll explain everything later. Here's your gun. Oh no, Alice is up. Hey buddy, why don't you go look after your sister? Okay. Who is at the door, Roger? It's somebody who wants something from me. Who is at the door? I swear to God, can you just... Binge Pipe is honored to be the new home of You Don't Know Jack. Binge Pipe, all the media you didn't know you wanted. Hey there, I'm Cookie, and Binge Pipe's got me on one of those celebrity fad diets where you only eat poisonous beetles. Mm-hmm. I can feel it working. Hey, I'm glad all eight of you decided to play this game. Anything to keep you off the streets. Okay, let's see what happens. To get things rolling, the brand of opportunities. If children's author P.G. Woodhouse wanted to rebrand himself as NC-17 Woodhouse, what title would he give one of his books? The f***ing inimitable Jeeves, or the wild things f***, Anne of Green f***ing Gables, or Goodnight Moon, you f***er. Who picked what? You need to find where the right answers are. <coughs> That's what you had in mind? P.G. Woodhouse wrote a series of children's books about a British butler named Jeeves. <coughs> it's better than learning about these kinds of butlers from their friends. Hallelujah, hallelujah. I call this one Gorillas in the Evaporated Water. Hey, bro. You ape? Sure, bro. I'm a baboon. Yeah, man. I'm a mandrill. It's a given. I'm a gibbon. Or, I'm in. I'm tamarind. So, what'd you pick? All the other three are monkeys. A gibbon is a type of ape. Why do we do it with three? Behold, steving is the hardest part. Except for something even harder like a dis or dat. I'm gonna read off seven movies, all featuring beloved character actor Steve Buscemi. For each one, tell me if Steve Buscemi's character is alive at the end of the movie, or Steve Buscemi's character is dead by the end of the movie. Answer quick, you'll only have a few seconds to choose between Buscemi lives, or Buscemi dies. And you're all doing this together, so look alive. Ready? Let's go. Reservoir Dogs. Huh? 
Armageddon! Fargo! Monsters, Inc! A big Lebowski. It turns out most people are average. Weird. Okay, let's move along. Here we have Clicklet. If Albert Camus had used clickbait to write The Stranger, what would have been his first line? 11 things everyone called Ishmael knows to be true. The 13 most pleasurable parts of burning. Mother died today and the clapback was insane. Or exterminators hate him. This guy woke up transformed into a monstrous vermin. And how do we do? If you ever replay this question, don't pick that one. Mother died today is the first line from Camus' The Stranger. If you click on existentialist clickbait, nothing happens because life is meaningless. Introducing The Nini's Have It. What does it mean if you refer to real housewife Nene Leakes as Nene Leakes, nay Johnson? She's changing her name to Johnson, her maiden name was Johnson, her nickname is Johnson, or she's from a town called Johnson. Let's see who got it. <laughs> Nay, after someone's name, is used to refer to their maiden or former name. Whatever you call her, say it to her face. Round one is over. Where's that beautiful scoreboard? Currently, player four is in the lead. And down here. These players could use a little help, and there's no shame in that. Oh, that means it's screw time. That's right, Cookie. Use the screw to make answering a question harder for all the other players. The results may surprise you, and you'll receive a monetary bonus for anyone who answers incorrectly. <clears throat> Great, thanks. The rest of you better answer fast if you don't want to be screwed. Oh, and by the way, all the cash in round two is doubled, in case you care about things like that. Time and fun stops for no one. Six trombones is not a parade. Coming up next, Dan Brown's got Renaissance men in different area codes. Based on international phone numbers, if Leonardo da Vinci had a cell phone, what would be da Vinci's code? 39, 44, 1... Oh, this'll be good. My friends, player two has unleashed the screw. Binge Pipe was going to make you read this eventually. Might as well be now. Okay, what'd you pick? Leonardo da Vinci lived in Italy, which has the country code of plus 39. So to call da Vinci, you'd need to dial plus 39, then his number. Now, da Vinci's pin number, that'd be something I'd like to crack. Nice screwing, player two. This is your cash now. And how'd the audience fare? Wow, you'd think a group of people who've chosen to spend their time watching other people play a video game would be smarter. That means that right answer is worth even more. Buy yourself something nice. Hey, question. We 
We'd like to initiate a moment of playful interactivity. Would you like a question with nuts or a question without nuts? Contribute your percentage of the choice now. Here are the votes. We graciously accept your choice. Mon béret a rétréci. Sept. Next up, a question without nuts. What's the name of the eunuch from Game of Thrones? Littlefinger, Lord Varys, Khal Drogo, or Hodor? So who got it? Hold the door! <laughs> Lord Varys was castrated as part of a bizarre magical ritual. Keep that in mind the next time a magician asks for a volunteer. Twas then I learned to beat the winds of it. Let's try bad words. Which of these subtitles for Netflix stand-up specials contains a word you won't find in Webster's Dictionary? Reggie Watts, Spatial, Dave Chappelle, Equanimity, Mark Maron, Thinky Pain, or Hannibal Burris, Comedy Commissado? Let's see how that shook out. I think you know it's coming. Uh, let's skip the insults. Nobody got it right. Thinky is not a word recognized by the Merriam-Webster Dictionary. <laughs> Different conjugations of think include thinking, thought, and the opposite of whatever you're currently doing. Na, 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 na. There is no hiding from... Octopus Coffee, Queen Elizabeth, or Frankenstein? Octopus Coffee, Queen Elizabeth, or Frankenstein? It's a monster. Was a recurring monster in the NBC series Grimm? Octopus Coffee, Queen Elizabeth, or Frankenstein? Hope you like what you picked. Oh, you tried so hard. Well, nobody got this one, so um, let's just move on with our lives. Adeline Shade was a frequently seen witch-like creature on Grimm, played by actress Claire Coffey. I watch Grimm every morning. Don't talk to me until I've had my Claire Coffey. Why not try Zeus's Build-A-Man Workshop? Which combination of these mythological hybrids would result in a regular full man? Head of a griffin, body of a centaur, head of a merman, body of a fawn, head of a sphinx, body of the minotaur, or head of the chimera, body of Pegasus? Okay, who chose what? That's a human head on a goat's body. That's an eagle head on a horse body. A sphinx has a human head and a lion's body. The minotaur has the head of a bull and a man's body. Now all you have to do is sew them together and voila, you've made an abomination. Ow. Welcome to the attack.
When you see an answer that matches the category, tap it on your device. The faster you pick a right answer, the more cash you make. And more than one answer can be right. But each time you're wrong, I'm taking some cash away. And be careful. It's gotta be a match that fits this clue. Good breeding. I hope you recognize the recognized breeds of these animals. Look. Five's got it! I gotta hand it to you, Player Five. That was a photo finish. A terrible, backlit, weird angle photo finish. But still... You don't know Jack! Truffles and tea cakes, tea cakes and truffles, I love them exactly the same. If you asked me to pick, I'd say that's a trick because I love them exactly the same. Oh! Deep in the American South, there was a town. Binge Pipes menu screen offers everything you need to start a trivia game.